Hey, welcome back to Smithy's over 100 golf courses in a year. Uh, today it's 25th of October. I base myself in all ahead for most of the week. I'm walking the Wales coastal path. But uh, a wee bit tired from yesterday, so instead of walking today, uh, come for a game of golf this afternoon. And we're at Hollyhead Golf Club. This is course number 195 this year. This is one of two 18 hole courses in North Wales that I've not played, the other one being Wrexham. So that's one of the gaps plugged. So let's go and see what it's got. Ladies and gentlemen, it's course number 195 of 2022. It's Hollyhead Golf Club. On the tee, the man who walked 22 miles on the Wales coastal path yesterday should have been doing another leg today, but the legs will only let him walk five miles round the golf course from Kirkintilloch in Scotland. Smithy! Alright, this is the opener at Hollyhead. Uh, short par four at 265 yards. Can't quite see where the green is. There's a wee mound in front, I think, unless it's right up in the top. This is the second hole at Hollyhead, par 3, 157 yards. That's quite dangerous, platform green. It's a big runoff if you're short. Some nasty rough left and right. But tough straight into the wind today, even harder. Ah, oh, this is a green at the second. Good effort from me into the wind. Not quite on the dance floor, but a foot off. But the opportunity still. Not an official one. Up to you at Hollyhead, uh, it's a long par 4, 433 yards, going down to the side It's going down into the valley and then rising up uh, This is still the third hole, this is the view from the top of the first hill Absolutely miles away today in a westerly wind, straight into it Long way Of when they say ocean, I mean the sea, break that quickly Oh number 4 at Hollyhead, another par 3, it's just a short one at 150 yards But it's right into the wind a lot of runoffs from the green walk on the right hand side from uh, it's a green tucked away in the left fence at the back. Fifth hole at Hollyhead, 385 yards, par four. Uh, tight drive in between the mounds and the, the bushes, left and right. And I think it's going to fade to the left a wee bit. We've got the advantage of the wind behind now, it would turn round away from the sea. Looking down at the sixth hole, another par three. Third one and six, 54 yards. Uh, down at the bottom, seventh is going to come across that way, crossing over. That's the seventh hole, 368 yards. Dog leg round to the left, you can just see the green up in the top left corner. Ditch running over, river at the back. Uh, three old guys in front of me there could quite easily uh, let me play through as they're walking 30 40 yards in front of me when I got to the tee. Not to be, could be a wee bit of fun here. This is looking up at the 8th green at Hollyhead after you come through the gap. That's a slight rise up to the green. Clubhouse in the first tee, next to the right hand side. This is the 9th at Hollyhead, 475 yards, uh, par 5. Uh, you get a wee bit of a walk, that's the 8th green up there. And it's actually crossing the 18th, comes down from the right up to the pin up there. So coming across, so just as well it's not busy. But the good news is the three old guys in front of me have buggered off into a clubhouse after eight. Hallelujah, Yahoo! Tenth hole at Hollyhead along par three, four three three yards, stroke index one. Mark a post out there. It's going to dog leg to the left down near the bottom. I'll have a wee pan round there. Head back over to the clubhouse there. I'll shoot round. Triarder Bay down the bottom there down the bottom part of the coast. I'll eventually be coming to Drew Arden Bay, walking the Wales coastal path. Mountain might be in a few days time, or even a few months time. Right, back to the golf. Hardly better give an update the half of the stage in the big match, 50 versus the golf course. I'm not at the races today, especially the putting green, so I'm three and a half short down to the golf course. Long way back. It's a long way down. Uh, of course, takes a different direction here. A bit of gorse, a ferns, bushes. I look round. So stack lighthouse away up over that way. Across the Hollyhead itself over there. That's a closer view of the green at the tenth. Really nice hole, this one. It's a long one, 220 yards. Oh, the wind's behind. So, 
give her a scalp, see what happens. I think I'm up that my head for 142 yards, hard four still. Uh, it's a long run, wind still behind. Uh, fades round to the left, we've got to follow in the line of the wall, which is obviously a bit of a We've got a noise from the, the jets, RAF Valley, not far away from here. Holyhead, last of the par threes, 170 yards, down the hill, tight with the bushes either side, uh, you've got to be straight or you're in trouble. Uh, 14th hole at Holyhead, short par four, 254 yards, but it's going to go up the hill. Looks like it's veering round to the right as well, yes it definitely is according to the board. Narrow again with the bushes, ferns, gorse, whatever it is, at the time of year, in the right hand and the left hand side. 15th hole at Holyhead, uh, par four, 388 yards. Elevated key down into the dip. Slight fade to the right, way up there. Almost straight ahead. The wind's uh, changed round. I'm heading towards the sea again. Uh, and earlier the wind was coming off. I see it's a westerly wind, but it's coming across from the left hand side. Uh, it's wind. Oh, that's a look down at the 16th green. So that's a long way. I've had two already, so it's my third one coming up. Long path forward, fourth area. I'll come at 17th at Holyhead, it's a shorter par 4, 315 yards. Almost blind, you've got to go across all the bushes, etc. To go onto the fairway there. I think it's going to go down the hill after. This is looking down at the 17th green from the marker post. Made a bit of a shape green. Either at the side. Uh, bunker left and right, I say it's down the hill. Nice shot. 18th, playing a hole at Hollyhead, 376 yards. Par 4, still at any southerly wind. Now, uh, the road to the left hand side, just past the trees there. So, I really don't want to go left. Sloping fairway, right to left. Marker post is positioned up to the right. And the green's a lot of platform with the green at the top. Just before the clubhouse up there. What's the score in the big match? Smithy versus the golf course. Easy win for the golf course, I'm four shots down. Uh, so approach up to the 18th, clubhouse in the background in the right there. That's a raised green, so I don't want to be short, some bunkers are bounding. Left, right, centre, right again. Well, it's becoming a wee bit dank and gloomy, much more so than the same time last night. It's half past five, it was getting dark after six o'clock last night. That's been a kind of dull day today. Let's get finished. Right, that's me, just finished on the 18th at Hollyhead. Uh, L shape course. Sort of goes out west at first, and then you come on to the northerly bit, front nine, the back nine. Front nine's much more linksy type, and the back nine there's more gorse, ferns about, it's more heathland. But the strange thing is, is the tuff's partland. That's what it's, it's, it's kind of confusing. It looks as if it should be lynx, and looks as if it should be heathland, but as I said, different type of turf. Uh, lots of varied tools. Uh, my favourite would be the tenth, uh, long par four. It's a par 68, so you would think it's going to be quite short, but there's some big long par, par 4s in there, just a one par 5. So it can be kind of tough in places. Uh, I've just got no energy today, after doing a long walk yesterday. Uh, I've got another back out walking tomorrow, so the golf's a wee bit like warm down. Just get like 4 or 5 miles in, or maybe 6 the way I was playing today. Uh, no, green's in very good condition, they're kind of like little spikes in them. They're little cores but uh, no they're running very very fast indeed they're good to put on but they're very fast uh, fairway is in nice condition yeah, it's a good course kind of funky what am I going to give it it's going to be a 7.75 for Hollyhead that's all for me out walking the coastal path tomorrow uh, get back to the golf course later this week thank you very much cheerio nearly forgot to give the final score in Smithy versus the golf course oh six shots up for the golf course that will do it easy win